Friends, look how scummy that piece of shit Coinbase chain is. Look at the amount of rugs here. I'm watching Stevie. Look at him just go through the amount of rugs. Watch. These were all rug pulls, all they've died. So I know that this was a rug pull. This was a rug pull. I think, here we go. This is another rug pull. This rug, is a rug, pull. rug. This is dead, dead, dead. Uh, that's looking like it's basically dead. This looks like it's basically dead. Pom, this was looking so promising. They look so promising. Look at this dead, 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 dead. This is the only one, Blubby, where I've actually made a video for 100X gem. I actually do believe that this can actually potentially go. This is the one that I'm actually really bullish on. So I'll be very curious to see if my picks, because I'm getting very, uh, very, I'm, I feel like I'm getting more in tune with the market that I can see. See, friends, like rug, 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 all freaking rugs. Listen, the personality of the founder of a chain, it basically spreads out to the people in the community. Vitalik, he is a very neutral guy. He's a bit spicy sometimes. He is politically independent. He's also like, government, this is your way. I will now follow. He's like that. Everyone in Ethereum is like that too. You can also guess what Satoshi's personality was really like by what Bitcoin maxis are like. You can guess that. All right. This happens with every chain. XRP, people look at Brad Garlic Breath. He's like, XRP is the most valuable asset in the world. Sell, 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 sell. <laughs> sell 30% below market price. That's what they really like. They're like, legally, I'm allowed to say it's the most valuable asset in the world. Sell, 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 sell. Corey Danzo, Charles Hoskinson. You understand? Likes writing a lot of papers and reading. That's the whole chain. Everybody in Corey Danzo is exactly the same way. They'll write 400 pages about how to tie your shoelace and put five ice cubes in your orange juice before they actually do it. So the personality, friends, it reflects on everybody. Remember, Elon Musk, fun, troll here and there. He chooses Dogecoin, natural fit. Now, what about Richard Hart and Polstein? Cult, fierce, 99% still here, not leaving, never leaving. You have a diverse amount of people. Friends, also interesting do you know Tangang and Mr. B Roots are parts of Richard Hart? You know that, right? Part of his soul. You know Tangang, spicy, ferocious rebellion. This is what we're here for. That's part of Richard Hart. And then you also have Mr. B Roots, showman, marketing, appealing stuff for you, catering to the wider audience. You see, Richard Hart has done both of them. Okay, everybody's in the is is a part of that. Now everybody is loyal. Cultists, okay? Cultists, friends, not a bad word, man. Go, give me straight 100% cult. You want to go look You want to go look at these freaking piece of trash rugs like Coinbase, Chain, and Soilana? Remember, friends, Soilana, who is the unofficial cucumber god of Soilana? It was Soy Bankman Freed. Yes, yes, M, M, Senator, yes, yes. Mr. Mr. Soy Bankman Freed. Can't even call him Mr. Mrs. I don't know what he, think, what he is, okay? It. Soy Bankman Freed was a Jeter. All right. He was relentlessly dumping customer Bitcoin funds at the top, capping the rally. He was also, whenever given a deal to help promote a yield farm or a project, he would farm everything and then dump it immediately and destroy the price aggressively. With Alameda, even though they kind of like went back up at the time, they considered like, oh, we're up plus 100% on this. Let's get out of everything. That's what they were considering. You see that? That all comes from Soilana. Now, if you go look around Soilana, what do you see, friends? You see VCs, scum, and jeters everywhere. Just jeters, thieves, ruggers. You see racist coins and all these other things. Friends, is it a coincidence that of all the chains, who was known for being a bit racist in all of crypto? Now, this is not racist. If you think this is racist, you're a bit of a weirdo. But what was the meme? Soy Bankman Freed said... Hey, CZ. So CZ from Binance, remember? He tweeted, he goes, uh, he's allowed back in Washington, isn't he? So he basically made a joke that, oh, because CZ is a Chinaman, he's a man from China, he's the unknown, he's not allowed to go back to Washington. Ooh, spooky. And everyone's looking at it like, bro, what a weirdo. <laughs> who, who, who thinks like that? You know, that, that's basically what happened. Is it a, it's not a coincidence, friends, that now we have racist coins appear on Soilana. They are a direct representative of his personality. You see that? What caught on? You don't see racist coins that are bubbling up on Pulse Chain or Phantom or Binance Chain. You don't see them. See? The personality of the founder 
it literally, the pieces of the soul around you. So every single person in the ecosystem, you can see they're a reflection of Richard Hart. You have the cult and loyalist. Now, you got to think about, that's why everyone goes to each chain. They go with what they like, but I, I'm looking at, okay, what's the highest value? Okay, now this one is hated. So people don't under, still under, don't understand cults, right? Bitcoin was a cult. Ethereum at the start was a cult. You understand? Still kind of a weird cult here and there, okay? All the big things that are around and survive. Cults. How did Corridanzo literally, friends, when was the last time you bridged into Corridanzo? Okay, you never have. All right, sweet. How the hell is it top 10? Cult. Cult. Because, you know, with Charles Hoskinson, we read 400 pages, how to tie our shoes. We're not wearing shoes. It's fluffy slippers. We read 400 pages and write a paper, a thesis. How do we place five ice cubes in the cup when there's only three? Okay, we've got to grab two. Do you grab two with one hand or two hands? This type of stuff, they're always working out with the maths formulas. Do you understand that? There's some sort of culty thing going on there. Wonderful to see. That's why Pulse Chain, hey, it's hated. It's hated. It is what it is. You notice though, Pulse Chain influencers, all of us who do content creators, you notice a lot of us are either love, hate, extreme. Mr. B Root, some say me. You flippy and the floppy. Oh, we like you. We hate you. Like that? That's Richard Hart. That's it, you, Richard Hart. Go watch his stuff. People like, I either really, really hate him, then I listen to him. Oh my gosh, he's so entertaining or he's really smart. You don't get that with Cardanzo. You don't get that with XRP. You don't get that with CZ. No one says, oh, they're a love or a hate guy. They're not extreme with this volatility. Do you understand that? So everyone is a reflection of where they go. Just so happens we're the most hated and contrarian, okay? This type of advanced stuff, it's for you. You're my friend. Like, subscribe, bell, but not catch you soon.